Let's see if we can find this sharky, Jess. You stay in one spot long enough that he'll swim by you. Oh, yeah. He yeah, just keeps circling. He goes up. Back there. How big is it? Um, Two meters. That, that big? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, that was beautiful. It's a yeah. shame. But it's good if you can get out. Yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> You'll have to get in your canoe and try Actually, like, yeah, when you look at him at first, he looks smaller, but he's not, he's actually bigger. Yeah. Yeah. How you going? Good, good, good. He'll be back in here in a minute. Back in here? Oh, he's doing go, he's going up there. Yeah. And then he turns around and he comes back around here and he actually turns around right here. Oh, does he? Yeah. yeah. He'll be around anyway. You'll see him. Awesome. <laughs> Dare you to jump in <laughs> off the swing. <laughs> oh yeah. Jump still there? Oh sorry. Yeah, We're hoping yeah. so. We've come to yeah, have a squeeze. Bronze way left. Yeah. He's right there. It's a beautiful shark in the estuary. Poor thing is just swimming up and down, up and down. Must be so stressed out. He's right there. So close, he's about a two meter. Hi darling. Hey. Yeah, see uh, his colour's bronze, mate. <laughs> bronze or gold. So it's... I know, I, just, I know that it had bronze in the name. That's so cool. So I was, when I was kayak fishing in here, someone told me there was a shark, or often a shark, swimming up and down. Um, yeah, and we've got this bronze whaler shark in the channel here. It's been in here for a couple of days now. So I'll see if I can pick him up on the camera. I did get some footage before. Um, you would expect that he would find his way back out to the open ocean. But uh, he's been in here for a couple of days now. It's good size too couple of meters. Is this him coming now? Yes it is. Check him out man, he's a beautiful animal.
is like being in a in an aquarium. Only this is nat natural. It's so much better when the wind's not around. The water's clear. What a creature. People pay a lot of money to do go and see something like this. <laughs> This is Green's Pool, part of William Bay National Park. And Jesse's got a couple of mates that he's uh, met at Denmark Caravan Park. And he's uh, out there snorkeling with them. Really protected. Great place for snorkeling because it's uh, it's a fishing exclusion zone. Uh, yeah, plenty of rays and fish see
Yeah. Going for a herring. A herring? Yeah. Oh, look, look, he's right, he's sitting right there. He's just sitting there. Oh, oh. No, you saw that. He didn't get up. Leather jacket. Good old leather jacket. Not bad eating. Do bite your hooks off when you're trying to catch them. The nice colourful stuff though, and a nasty big spine on his head can do a bit of damage. Beautiful colours underwater, these fellas. Hopefully we'll see a few of these tomorrow snorkeling. This one's uh, a bit of days I think. A couple of blokes that live on rural properties here that have ocean frontage, just talking to them. They were having a bit of a fish off the rocks. It must actually be the edge of the national park here, so cannot fish um, over here to the left, but anything to the right is okay. That's Parry's Beach. So they rode their four wheelers over here to have a bit of fishing. Nothing, they didn't catch anything off the beach either, so fishing wise, it's a bit pretty quiet at the moment. Hopefully that changes soon.